Hi, this is Jared Dees with Ave Maria Press. I'm just going to provide a quick couple of tips for subscribing to a blog or news RSS feed using Google Reader. So here at the Google homepage, and I've already created an account, I'm going to open Google Reader by finding the little word Reader um, in the above menu bar. So I'll click there. You can see I haven't added any RSS feeds, blogs, news, uh, videos, etc. Um, so I'm going to do that now. If you're new to this, you can check out some of Google's tutorials. There's a video and a little um, explanation of everything you're seeing here if you're seeing it for the first time. So what I'm going to do is go to I'll go back to the Google homepage. I'll find one of my favorite websites. We can go to um, Ave Maria Press click on their home page. You can see there's a couple of different RSS feeds um, through our website. One for news and one for the Engaging Faith blog. So I'm going to go there. And you, you know that there's an RSS feed if there is a little icon um, that looks like an orange signal here. Or if you see the words that so say subscribe to RSS. So I'm going to click there. And you can see the, the different blog posts that, that have been updated. And this is the feed catching um, the updates from the blog and, and placing them here in actually something called FeedBurner. And so I wanted to subscribe using Google. I could choose some other options if I wanted to. Subscribe now. And I can choose to add it to my home page or add it to Google Reader. And then we're going to add it to our Google Reader. And I'll sign in here. You can see, there it is. There's one of our subscriptions. is the Ave Maria Press blog or the Engaging Faith blog. Um, what I like to do is that I, I add an RSS feed to the Google Reader because it, as you'll probably find if you start using it, you'll start to have a lot of different feeds is to organize them into different folders. So I want to create a new folder and I'll just call it Religious Education. And there you have a, a little um, folder. So as I add new things, maybe some of my hobbies or interests as well, I can always add in uh, websites that have ideas for um, teaching religious education here under this folder. And it's very simple. You just scroll down for the different posts um, that have been added, or you can choose from a long list of posts. You can see the many things we have posted here and select the ones you want to read. Um, once a new one pops up, for example, when this this idea is posted on the, on the website, it'll, it'll shift everything down in a new um, blog post or news feed will, will pop in. So if you're using this to follow a website or follow a blog or follow um, a news site, all you have to do is log in, click on the, the site you want, and you can read it here or go right to click on the title and go to the website itself, and there it is.